Where? I don't remember. Czechoslovakia, I see. Why Czechoslovakia? Do you like those countries? Not more than any other. And now you're coming to England. That's right. What for? I told you to enjoy myself for fun. I'm not stupid, you know. Tell me why you've come to England. The truth. What do you do in life? I'm a researcher. And what kind of research might that be? Sorry, excuse me. Why am I stuck outside here? Keep out. Please, let me explain my case. Keep out, I'm telling you. You're not gonna settle my case without me. Keep out and wait until you are called. Is that clear? Just ah, you're just gonna put me in jail. Go on. Why nobody listens to me? Okay. Now just you okay. sit down there and don't okay. move. Understand? Everything's gonna okay. be all right. Okay. I would like to know what I am accused of. Why am I being held like this? What exactly is the charge? What kind of laws authorize you to treat me this way? I see here that you've got a Tunisian friend in London. What does he do? He works at the BBC. Oh, there are Arabs at the BBC? Yes. He's the one who covered the religious service at the death of Lord... Uh, what's his all name? All right, all right. I suppose it's about as true as you being a researcher. And what kind of research might that be? Scientific. What kind of science? Occult sciences. You know. Sorcery, black mass, vampirism, and uh, psychoanalysis. Uh, I see, I see. Now tell me, how long have you been in Belgium? And another now thing... that's I'll... enough. You've succeeded in putting me off the idea. I'm not going to London anymore. Give me all that junk, I'm turning back. Get undressed. I beg your pardon. You didn't get me. I told you I'm not going to London. Do you mind? You're not in order. For the moment, you're at British customs and you're subject to the British law which I represent. So get undressed if you don't mind. Otherwise, you will be undressed. Why did you leave your country, Mr... Why did you come through the Iron Curtain? Because I'm a communist. Come, come. <laughs> you mean because you're not a communist? Um, the fact is... <laughs> I didn't want to be a soldier. The army, you know? I refused the army. It's okay? Ah, military service. That sounds better. What are you doing in England, mister? But I told you already. I go to see my aunt in London. Look, here's her address, and here's her photo. She'll give me money, then I go to Canada. I don't stay here. You must believe Look me. Here. There's no work for you in England. We've got enough unemployed but, already. But listen. I'm sorry, I can't let you in. Please, please, let me explain you. What are you doing with this thing? It's very dangerous, you know. I do nothing bad with it. It's to be clean, to be correct. It's for shaving me. Mm, really? You don't use it very often, do you? <laughs> but you know, for shaving I need also soap, water, a basin, a... Consistent days. Well, in that case, I've got a surprise for you. You can have it back.
Thank you. Very kind of you. Please, let me explain you. I get money from my aunt. And you think you can come to England with that? Please, let me explain you. I've already told you. What I now? Can't let you in. But what's be quiet, the reason you. you Nobody asked I'm you sorry, anything. sorry, there's nothing more to be said. There's no point in arguing. But, but please. If you want to play at politics, you can do it in your own country. We've got quite enough political unrest here already. Political what? Who says anything about politics? But I told you already, I go to see my Get aunt. dressed. Now, get out. The search is over. I see here that your residence permit in Belgium expires in a few hours. What have you got to say to that? Do you take drugs? I asked you a question, do you take drugs? What do you think I am doing at this very moment? This paper found in your person proves you're interested in drugs. It proves whatever you wanted to prove. Listen, I'm not going to keep you very much longer. But you can think yourself lucky. The new year is on your side. And we don't want to be nasty at a time like this, do we? Of course. You must have your truces like everybody else. Your papers are not in order. You cannot enter the country. Here's a form which you can fill in if you want to dispute my decision. That's your right. Have you finished? Can I go now? We'll show you. You'll spend the night on the boat and tomorrow you'll go back to Belgium. Your papers will be returned to you tomorrow in Ostend. Apropos? Bon a e Rosanne. Ladies and gentlemen. May I ask you to raise your glasses for the good health of our Turkish colleagues, Captain Dalaitli and his lieutenant, who we have the honor to have amongst us this evening. Thank you with all my heart. Good evening. I'm uh, sorry to interrupt the party, but uh, this chap has been refused entry by the British authorities. These are his documents. Could you make sure they get to the Belgian authorities, please? Hmm. Les Anglais nous ont encore ramené un polichinelle d'Angleterre. Ils ne respectent même pas la trêve du Nouvel An. Thank you, gentlemen. Allez vous installer là-bas. On va vous servir quelque chose. Yann. Bienvenue à bord. Je n'ai pas faim. Mais c'est pas bien ça, monsieur. Ils ont été vaches avec toi, l'enfant Sandy. Mais tu sais, le dîner est bon. Et en plus, c'est gratuit ce soir. Je n'ai pas faim. Bon, mais alors tu boiras bien quelque chose. 
Allez, c'est nouvel an, il faut s'amuser, mon vieux, hein Tu sais, d'habitude, les types comme toi, qui doivent dormir ici. À 9h30, ils sont au lit. Mais aujourd'hui, c'est différent. C'est de m'importuner. 